can never ever find the right words and there's no way this is real life there's no telling you Good morning guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another video. And today guys, we're in the white interior, I'm super stoked for this. We are heading down to the shop right now, and then hopefully getting our new seatbelt. LND Solutions already texted me 10 in the morning, so they already finished the seatbelt, so that's perfect. The only one I have right now is the driver one, so I'm gonna go ahead and trade with them. Give him this one, take my other three, install all those, and then just wait on him to finish this one, and we should be good to go in terms of seatbelts and the interior in this video. And then hopefully also go stage two, and pretty much get this car exactly where I want it. My goal for this 435 is to build one of the best 435s out there. So if you guys are thinking of doing just that, make sure to smash that like button and show me some love. Doing stuff like this is very expensive. I could have bought a whole other build instead of seats like this, but I felt like this is something that makes my car unique. And not to mention, this is the Dakota package, so it just looks so good. I'll catch y'all when I'm actually at the shop talking to LD Solutions. We finally made it down to the shop. I'm not gonna make the same mistake and have these two garage door open. They do bring in a lot of light, but my, I have I'm really like either sick or allergies and uh, I don't know what's going on with me. Hopefully, I mean, I heard the coronavirus is a whole lot worse. So hopefully I don't have that. But uh, I'm gonna keep the garage doors closed so all that stuff and debris don't come in. And we're gonna go ahead and just remove the driver's seat belt. So as you guys can see, both seats are in here looking beautiful. Um, but yeah, we, gotta, we have to remove that seat belt again for the driver. Take it over to L&D Solutions to pick up the other three and put together this whole entire side. All we're missing on that side is just a door panel and the rest interior should be in um, while they do that last seat belt. So let's go ahead and get that seat belt out. Should be pretty easy, but before we do that, we need to unplug the battery and uh, just get straight to work. I don't even know if I got that on camera, but I went ahead and removed the driver's one. So let's go ahead and go down to LED Solutions real quick. Even though they are the homies, uh, better safe than sorry. I'm gonna go ahead and get my gloves on, my mask on, and uh, we should be good to go. As we got our belt, I got my keys on me. Uh, let's head down to LED. It's crazy how close they are. A company that I'm really trying to work with and uh, they're literally across the street. So that's my shop. And uh, let me just keep talking so I can show you guys, you know, no cuts, no nothing. Make sure my, oh shit, let me get, Put my mask back on. Okay, um, so just gonna hop in over here. How come this mask gonna go on? It's like I got small or something. And uh, we're here at LND Solutions. Yep, that's, uh, that's that's pretty much how close it is. It's kind of crazy. Ah, his car is right there. That's why I didn't see him. We're just waiting on Dennis. I think he's getting the belts right now. What's going on, bro? Thank I'm shaking bacon. I'm good. So uh, he's been doing. So what, what's the seatbelt color that we end up going with? The seatbelt color? Yeah, the color. You, it was such a long time ago that we ordered. It's it's just to match your car. Yeah, as perfectly as possible. my car is like a weird copper that I don't even know the exact color code for. Yeah, so it's I like an it. orange, but like not an orange. Yeah, exactly. And, like and then my steering wheel is actually copper. orange. <laughs> so. Whatever that kind of looks good from a distance. It'll look really good. It, it should look good. So I'm uh, super hyped for this. Uh, let's check it out real quick. I put it in this Walmart bag, by the way, guys. <laughs> the, the, okay. Damn, okay. It's gonna match your paint really well. Damn, this looks so good. Did I have to, sh I have to show you the car as soon as I finish it? Oh yes. I'm almost done with that, I'll swing by. Look at that. Oh my god. This actually matches your outside wrap. Dude, that's a lot actually, better, yeah, a lot than, better the than the steering wheel. wheel. Exactly. That's actually yep, looks yep, so yep. good. This is like a custom color order, so this is this is not something we just have. We have to really find it, but I mean they got a lot, but um yeah, I I, I was picky and I was like <laughs> That's good? No, it yeah, looks yeah. really good. No, it looks super good. Put it on your car, yep. bring out the driver one and let me know. Coco, cool, cool. awesome. So uh yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and give him the driver one and then we'll be back. I gotta I gotta put the rest of the interior together and then I have to show it to you. Yes, let's okay, go cool. look Okay, awesome. Look got out um, pretty much LND Solutions. They pretty much rebuilt seat belts. They do custom seat belts. So if you get in an accident and your belt gets seized up, reach out to LND Solutions. The logo is right there. Website's linked down below. He actually has a V10, actually not a V10, I think the new ones are V8s. Twin turbo M5, white on red, super clean M5. But yeah, I don't know if you guys can see me. It is super bright out today. But anyhow, super stoked on these little puppies. Go ahead and install them and then pick up our new seat belt, finish up the interior. But yeah, again, Huge shout out to LND Solutions for working with me today. Th this car is becoming literally a dream car of mine. I've been I, like, this is the exact spec I've always dreamed it to be, and I'm just so, so, so happy that it's actually coming true. Anywho, guys, uh, look like I have a double chin. Let's go ahead and go inside. All right, guys, LND Solutions just came over. I didn't show them on camera just yet because, uh, you know, they were just helping me out with the seat belts. I couldn't figure out why the rear ones wouldn't pull out. And that's because they're apparently leveled. You know, when you're actually in your seat, you can pull it. But if you're not in your seat, you can't pull it. So I, I, I was just stupid. You know, I didn't really think, I didn't use my brain. Anywho, so the seat belts are in and it looks absolutely killer. So this probably matches the wrap more than the actual steering wheel. But that's because the steering wheel is orange and like, you know, it's kind of hard to match all these colors and stuff. But anywho, the gist of it looks really good. You guys can see the idea I'm going with and it looks so good. Especially you can see the stripe on the steering wheel too. Cannot wait to get the other ones and even the rear ones in. Let's get straight to work. We got a lot of work to do. Let's go ahead and get these rear ones in.
All right, guys, door panels are all in, rear seats are in. These seat belts are just glowing. It looks so good. Oh my God. Let's just go ahead and get the rear seats in and now officially complete the interior. All right, guys, here is how she's looking right now. So check it out. This is my dream interior and finally got the rear seats in as well. I'm going to pull this forward, um, but check that out, guys. Oh my God, this will, de this will definitely need a bigger detail, hopefully down the road. But as for now, like just check it out, guys. These seatbelts kind of glow with the light hitting on them, so it looks super good. And what I like about these seats also, when you take off the seatbelt, sometimes it catches on this right here which is super nice and it just sits like that. And at the same time, this lever will come out and grab it for me. So that's super cool as well. Overall, I'm super, super happy with this interior. Um, I did accidentally close the trunk and I had the batteries disconnected. So now I'm gonna have to figure out a way to jump the car, get the battery connected and see if everything is good to go. See if the mechanism is coming out, pull my seatbelt, see if all that stuff is good to go. And then I'm gonna plug in the computer and go stage two. Once I go stage two, I'm gonna go down to LND Solutions because huge shout out to them for helping me out with these seatbelts. They even came down to you when I couldn't figure out how to put them back in and uh, they helped me out. So shout out to them, really good guys. And I'm gonna let them take it out for a spin on stage two. So I'm barely gonna even enjoy it on stage two and let them drive it first and let them rip it. See what they think about it with the burble two and everything. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys get their reactions because I know I love it, but just in case y'all thinking that I'm maybe a little bit over exaggerating, let's see what they think about it. Guys, check that out. Now I might have to go wide body. Like the seats are so aggressive. I think I need to go wide body now. Oh my God. This is crazy. This is beautiful. Actually, before I start up the car, since the car is cold, I'm gonna install a new cage on it. Basically, it has a new gasket on it, new cage, all that good stuff. Uh, my cage is actually broken. It's missing the spring piece, but it's been working well. Uh, but just in case, I did order a new cage and I wanna put this in and replace it so nothing bad goes wrong. So let's go ahead and take off this oil filter and replace the cage. So if you guys look at this head, it's just, it's broken. See the inside of it? It's completely missing. So let's go ahead and replace that. All right guys, now that the car is fully ready to get tuned, uh, we just need to get some power to it, obviously. John is to the rest. He's gonna go ahead and bring his car right here so we can jump the car. Once we get it dropped, I think I'm gonna give it a good wash. It is so dirty. I'll show you guys the rear of it. It's so dirty. I'm gonna give it a good wash, tune the car, and then take it down to L&D and let them drive it because I'm pretty sure this is gonna be insane once it goes stage two. Copper a good wash. Let's go ahead and set you guys up and uh, spray her down. I'm actually low-key very excited. All right, guys, car is fully cleaned up. It looks so good. Uh, so yeah, I have a matching cable. I decided, you know, why not? But um, other than that, other than the interior, like I, I just want to get this seat fixed up. I think I have LND Solutions work on that. And you guys, huge shout out to LND Solutions for the belts. Um, I think they're absolutely gorgeous. If you guys want to pick up belts like this or even get custom ones, or if yours are blown out and you need to get them fixed, don't buy new ones. Reach out to LND Solutions. Again, they're gonna be linked down below. Logo's right there. And uh, they'll hook you guys up for a good price. Without further ado, I think you guys are excited to see stage two. So let's put this thing in stage two and turn off the burbles all the way and let's see how this thing sounds. Damn, this is a lot quicker than the first time. The first time took super long, guys. The second time, what I've heard from Keys Motorsports, it's super quick. As you guys can see, it's just climbing up. Literally in no time, it's gonna be stage two. Okay, I mean, 99 already? Shoot, that was only like literally five seconds. Three, two, clearing codes to all ACUs. All right, just like that, guys, we are good to go. I'm gonna go ahead and just disconnect. I think we are officially good to go. Let's go ahead and get in here. Okay, let's see if all the lights are cleared. Okay, cool, cool. So I think, yeah, the airbag light's still gonna be there. I don't know what's going on with that, but I'm probably gonna talk to Nick and see uh, what's going on exactly. But anywho, uh, let's go ahead and hear how this car sounds. All right, guys, here's from the inside cabin. So hear this, guys, this thing sounds insane. Oh my God, that's crazy. Okay, okay, all right, but let's go ahead and take it out and see what stage two is like. Um, you trying to go out for a spin? All right, I'm gonna give the camera to you, all right? So just, you do your thing, don't worry about it. And John has the corona, that's why I have the mask. <laughs> nah, it's a lot of people here today. I'm trying to get married one day, have kids, you know, grow old, die. Not now, you know. <laughs> grow old and die. Oh, 
my god. Brakes good. Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Ah. The boy got bars. <laughs> <laughs> I'm working on it. Okay. He's gonna do a flyby. All right, guys, we just went ahead and parked the 435. But guys, check out them seatbelts. Oh my god! All right, let's go ahead and thank uh, Dennis and his brother real quick. Remember, LND Solutions, y'all. What's up, bro? How you doing? I'm good. So I want you to drive it real quick. At the burbles, there's something going on with it right now. I don't know why. It, like goes on and off. All right. What do you think of the seatbelts, bro? Seatbelts look really good. Damn! I appreciate mm -hmm. you, bro. Okay. So, not as tall as you, so I have to. Oh yeah, you do, you, bro. It's all good. <laughs> Look at these okay. seatbelts, damn! My little brother has a 335, also tuned stage two plus, so. It sounds crazy, honestly, he's the one that inspired me. I was like, you know what, send it. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's really good with, with the tune. These cars need it. Yeah, no, 100%. You don't have to be friendly, don't worry. That's full coverage. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't, you know? <laughs> Guys, I have to figure out the verbal situation before I go home. I need to enjoy it. Yes, <laughs> it makes a difference. Yeah, I know, 100%. I'm so upset with that, I don't know why. Tonight is the night. <laughs> Should I buckle up? Yeah? So what kind of question is that? He's like, oh, it's gonna be so slow, I don't need to buckle. The disrespect. This thing's pretty smooth. Right, for bags? You see, both of them complimented that. You guys, bags has honestly come a long way. You guys need to like, do some research. Ah, they're sleeping. <laughs> they are sleeping. I don't know what's going on. They're tripping. I love this wheel. It's like a good thing. Right? <laughs> <laughs> these seats are really nice too. Yeah, I know, bro. I'm so happy with these seats. Hey! Hey! <laughs> Look who woke up. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I'm about to just park my car real quick and then we're gonna go ahead and go in Dennis's car. Damn! All right, so is there a big difference? Was, was that disrespectful? You'll see. <laughs> yeah, you clicking all the buttons and shit? Yep, drifters. <laughs> oh, so that's what I'm missing out on. <laughs> To swap my motor <laughs> should i get an f4 motor guys <laughs> i don't know but um 
I gotta show them somehow it's aired out. Oh my god, I love this interior. Guys, finally washed the car, posted in front of LND Solutions uh, M5. Honestly, it's a beast. It's a beast. I, I need, I, I'm probably gonna get an M car. Uh, I'm talking to my fiance. I kind of want her to get an M car. <laughs> so we'll see. We're gonna have to get an M car on the channel. But um, yeah, uh, that, that was that was a joy, bro. Yeah. That was crazy. That is, bro, I can only imagine if you had an exhaust on there. Uh, there, I was actually with one yesterday that had an exhaust. It, it, it's it probably is crazy. Yeah, it's a oh my god. Woo! That's a good spec, bro. Red on red on white. Oh my god. All right, guys. I'll, I'll talk down a little bit. And guys, that officially ends the video. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you smash the like button. I actually think I want to race that M5. If you guys want to see that on the channel, if you guys want to see a POV perspective with the M5, let me know down below. And without further ado, guys, I love y'all so much. Cop a decal or cop some merch to support the channel. And we'll probably get back to the 6 Series in a little bit. All right, guys. Remember to stay humble. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Guys, I filled up the gas tank and now my burbles are working. I guess when you're out of gas, the car is like, you can't waste any more, baby. <laughs>